Hello guys, yo, welcome to Wemima. Uh, Yay, you can see your girl is chilling at the beach today. And um, I'm right here in Ocean City Beach, Maryland. It's quite boring here, but I'm so I'm gonna show you some attractions um, on Ocean City. And um, then I'll be moving to Asatic Beach. Asatic Beach, they have some wild horses there. Those wild horses, you can't touch them and you can't ride them because they're wild, the world wild. But I'm gonna go there and show you guys those wild horses. But right now, I'm chilling. I'm gonna go towards the water now, play around. <laughs> then show you some attractions of the beach, okay? So, see you soon. All right, guys. So you can see people lying around. It's just um, a weekday and um, it's kind of boring, but you know. Um. I'll be going towards the fun area soon where we have the roller coasters and all that and I'm also going to go to Asatic Beach to show you guys the wild houses but meanwhile next we're going towards the water now okay I'm gonna show you the water like you've never seen the beach before right <laughs> so guys this is the beach and the water gosh I can't go in too much so as you can see, this is a uh, an airplane making. I mean, like an ad or something. Yeah. Ooh, gosh, it's cold. Let me go closer. It's very cold there. Eh? Wow! Woo! Yeah, so so cool. I hope you are enjoying the fish. That fish they call it fish. Ah, this water is cold. Yeah. Yeah, man. <laughs> I'm so lazy here. Yeah. <laughs> I can't come and die. Ah, I'm in pop. I'm in pop. Oh, pop. Oh, pop. Oh, pop. Oh, pop. Oh, pop. Oh, Chai. Enjoy my tissue, though. Oh, I'm in a vacation. Ah! Oh, look at all. Yes! Christy! Oh! Ooh! so cold <laughs> so on to the next attraction guys okay i'm running to the next attraction to show you the next attraction
So they're actually turning this place to, I don't know where that bridge is in um, Europe, where you have padlocks of people proclaiming their love. You know, this is Annie Lisa, Annie and Lisa, April, you buy padlocks and um, the padlock can put the name of you and your lover and lock it. You lock the love forever. See, Michael and Brenda, now and forever. Devin and Maya, you know. I should come and lock my name with um, Dangote's name, yeah. With me and Aliko Dangote. <laughs> oh, goodness. So, this is the bridge looking towards the ocean. So, we have more padlocks here. We have more of them here. I'm giving this like five or ten years to come. It's gonna be so much that they have to take a nap. But it's gonna weigh down the bridge. So if you wanna check the panoramic view, you need to pay um, a dollar for each person to go in and check the panorama panoramic view. And you have more padlocks in there. More padlocks.
So this is going to go all the way up. So this is the entrance of the boardwalk. So we'll be walking on it's called the boardwalk. You see where people are walking like going back and forth. So this is the entrance of the boardwalk. Because it's difficult to walk on the sand and they made um a walkway board like you know, where you can walk on. You see people walking on the board. And um, also on the board. You have side attractions left and right, restaurants, stores where you can buy stuff. I actually bought a beach tour there because I forgot to bring it to our home. So this is the entrance. So there's this sand, I don't know what I call, what I call this. It's like a sand castle. So we have your alive again. All are welcome. I think it's talking about Christianity. Something like that. So you can see the beach is all over there. And uh, we have the boardwalk right here, right the other side. The large, and I told him that by bringing each end up, it could be perceived from my hand up that these three ropes were equal in length, correct? Thank you, guys. You make my job easy. All I had to do was snap, wave, and pull, and I had three equal ropes. That, of course, rope number one, rope number two, and rope number three. Now, he asked me, he said, Christian, how do you do that? I said, I'm really not sure. All I know is that when I start the trick, I start with a small rope medium rope and a large rope and that's about as far as i can get with the rope trick here we go listen carefully thank you i impressed two of you awesome dave two minutes and a big finale that everybody yeah, standing yeah. here is going to remember the rest of their lives dave all you need to do is watch and listen i'm going to help you get there Are you ready dave if i remove this ball and i tap the cup how many balls are now under the cup one very good dave if i remove the ball dave and i tap this cup how many dave are you kidding me, Dave? I thought you understood what was going on. Dave, where are you from? Pittsburgh. Pittsburgh? Awesome, man. I'll go slower. Watch, Dave. I put them both away. Put them both away at the same time, Dave. How many, Dave? No, Dave. Orange. Listen, you had your chance, okay? Dave, we're going to try it with the hat. You ready? Dave, how many balls are on the table? That's an orange, Dave. And Dave, it's not on the table anyway. Two, Dave, how many balls are in my hat? Zero. Everybody watch closely. This hat is going to amaze each and every one of you standing here right now. You ready, Dave? Dave, I cover those two balls with the hat. Dave, I tap the hat. 
How many balls are now under the hat? <laughs> Four. Dave, I put those there. I didn't know if you did, man. Remember, I'm like a ninja. Dave, I do that for a reason. It's called misdirection. Not only did you see me hide the extra balls under the hat, everybody standing here did, right? And what that means is for that moment, each one of you lost focus of the cups. Dave, while nobody was focused on the cups, you see, I hide another orange underneath the one. That's how the trick is done, Dave. Make sense? Apparently that only impresses that girl. Okay, here we go. Listen carefully. Before we get to the big finale of my show, it is very important to again mention that this is how I make my living, bringing joy, amazement, and entertainment into all of your lives. Again, nobody pays me to stand here except for you. Now, I know that each one of you here may not be able to afford a 10 to throw inside of my hat. I understand that, and I appreciate that. The only thing I ask is that each one of you watching, please just give what you can afford. In saying that, there may be one or two of you who can afford a 10 or a 20. If you can, I want it. That's right, because I'm busting my butt for all your entertainment. And it Seriously, I don't know why I'm filming this. I don't know what the policeman is doing. Just going on in cycles with yours. But it's all filming, right? It's a part of the side attraction. It's like... Oh, it's coming towards us. Yay! Can you see? That is a well fed us. No, those ones on Elegushi Beach. <laughs> Show off. Okay, enough of that. So these are the um, wild horses, like it's already late, you can see that they are blocking the road. We don't know how we're going to pass this road now, like we can't, they're blocking the road. Stop. <laughs> so they're actually wild horses, you can't touch them, you can't feed them, you can't do anything about with them. They're actually cameras here, right? So, uh, wow, so I'm going to pass. Jesus. <laughs> we have to take one way, or we need to wait for the sources to pass. I'm super scared. Hit the car by going into the water. Uh, that is so close. Oh my god, it's so wild. Hello, guys, you're welcome back. So, I just got back from the beach and I'm so tired, I just need to go sleep right now. So I really appreciate you watching my video today. You can see my grooves at Ocean City and Asatic Beach. And I hope you enjoyed the video. Please don't forget to like this video, share with your friends who wants to go to Ocean City and Asatic Beach. And subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to follow me on Rich LINC on Instagram. Um, Twitter uh, is um, when you speaks. <laughs> my Facebook is Wemimo Wemimo. Thank you so much. See you guys. Good night. Love you. Bye. Ciao.